Welcome back everyone. It's finally that time of the year. It's time to make life a little easier on the homestead. And the first step in doing that is to get some shelves built in the Connexes. So let's get after it and quit wasting daylight. My plan is to build shelves along this wall because this is the secondary door, not the primary door. I'll be going in and out, so it'll be closed most of the time. I wanna build shelves from the floor up to the roof, the whole way back, but I'm gonna start back a few feet for so I can put some tall stuff right here leaning up against the shelves. So let's get a few things moved around and figure out these shelves. <laughs> I dug out eight uh, two by fours I got from Michael from not so remote Alaska last summer. These are left over from various projects. And I need eight for the upright pieces for that conic. So let's get these cut to length. I have my six uprights and now I'm gonna cut out notches so I can recess the horizontal boards into them. So I'm gonna go the top of the board's gonna be 34 and the bottom will be 30. And what this will do is it'll make the front nice and smooth. There won't be a board sticking out. I have all the wood over here. I have my three back pieces. I have all the horizontals. I have the three front pieces and then I have the cross pieces. Having these shelves in here is gonna make my life so much easier here on the homestead because I'll be able to organize everything in here and also be able to get to it when I need it. Having everything in here and out of my white trailer over there means I can sell that trailer and recoup my money for buying these Connexes. Let's get these shelves made and move on to the other Connex. Doing stuff by yourself just makes it that much harder.
I definitely need to pick up a box of three, three and a half inch screws and put in each, each one of these. These are two and a half inch and they're only going in probably less than a half inch. So I definitely need to pick up longer screws. This won't be nearly as difficult because I got the notches cut out for the boards on this side. So let's get this done. I'm gonna put some 28 inch cross bracing in two on each leg and then the shelves will stand up by themselves. So let's get this done. This is a lot harder trying to do it by yourself. That one wasn't too bad. I doubt it'll go as easy as the other one. too bad the first two were very difficult <laughs> this is what happened when you use screws that are too short these say they're two and a half inch screws I'm going into boards that are two inches thick but there's maybe a quarter of an inch. So these aren't two and a half inches long. Well, that didn't work out very good.
Let me go and get some long screws and start over. I just ran down to the local hardware store, got some three inch screws. I wanted to get three and a half inch or four inch, but they didn't have any. The first thing I'm gonna do is the pieces that are still together, I'm going to sink a three inch screw into the pieces to hold them together. So let's get this done. <sighs> Let's see if I can't get the two pieces together now.
this is getting frustrating. I bet that screw wasn't in there three sixteenths of an inch and it would just not come out. Okay, at least it'll stand now.
Well, I got the shelves built. I just need to get some plywood on them. Now, tomorrow or the next day, I'll work on the other shelves in the other Connex. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss the next video where I finish these shelves off and install Starlink at the homestead. Thanks everyone and have a good day.